Hi everybody. So today we're going to make uh, what I call art trading cards. I believe other people call them that also. I have this sprocket photo of me standing in front of this uh, metal deer. It's made out of metal. It looks like driftwood, but it's actually metal. And it's in Deer Park. And this goes to show you how tall this deer is. So, and I got it here in black and white too. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna keep this close to me so I can keep an eye on um, the color that we're gonna go with. And um, we're gonna use um, ink to, to mostly um, design these um, cards. We got sketch ink and golden ra uh, golden root uh, toasted walnut. Uh, Noodler's Lexington Gray. Noodler's Sequoia Green. Where the green it fell down there to him. I don't know. He put a catfish in the tree. Okay. And then uh, Noodler's Pecan. Uh, I'm not sure how to say that. It's, it's, it's a pecan color. And um, fountain pens. So we got Kikuno Fine. We got a Moon Man, which is also a fine. And we got a Fude, um, which Lexington Gray is in. Um, the tip is bent. And hopefully that's something that you can see. It is, okay. All right. We are going to try and get this, um, this deer. So, um, we'll start with this. We're going to start with the sketching. It's going to get us our, our basic deer. So let's see how we do. And I, um, I don't know. It's kind of my style, just a rough in, um, rough in um, the deer. So I'm okay with with that, and we're just gonna end up with a uh, the back end of the deer on this particular card because I started it out too big. Let's get it up there and. See if this if this works nice. That's how um, Okay, so that's pretty much a, a um a small, smaller type, um, uh, oh, I lost my words. <laughs> it's just a small little area of the deer and that's fine. Now we're going to go on to the, um, the pecan. Because what we're going to do is we're going to wet this down and we're going to watch this deer come to life. And that's the plan. We're always being hopeful. Always being hopeful. Okay, and then we have Sequoia Green, which is where he's standing. 
know it don't look like much. Just give it a minute and you'll you'll see. All right. And the toasted walnut is also going to go on the on the deer structure. It just adds a little darker color to this. I have um, done this before. I never put it on any videos, and it's there in my sketchbooks. Um, I'd have to look them up to show you, but I don't know where they are at the moment. I have way too many sketchbooks. Oh, wait a minute. I take that back. A person cannot have too many sketchbooks. I just like playing with my inks, so. All right, and then the Lexington Gray is in the background. So we're gonna do some tall trees, like these, these tall trees here. And, um, one thing that I didn't bring out was some blue, and I have some Noodler's blue for um, in the trees up here. So let's let's go ahead and put some in there. Let's try this out. Uh, it looks kind of corny, but it's so sweet. Okay. All right, I have a size six black velvet. Are you ready? This is either gonna work or it's gonna trash it. So we have some green. It's under the deer. Which is actually in this photo where I'm standing but I'm not trying to make a complete photo. And we have the gray. Lexington gray, which doesn't seem to want to run too much. And that's actually fine. The Noodler's blue definitely goes places. And I know that these two colors definitely go. And we got the moon, we got the um, the toasted walnut and the pecan, which is these two here. Um, Noodler's pecan. They actually. Um, lend very well to draw, uh, making the, your art pop. You don't have to use any um, watercolor if you use these colors. And it's kind of a hit and miss. You just, most, most inks will bleed. And um, some of them like to say they won't. So in this particular case, I would, the sketch ink won't. The Noodler's um, uh, Lexington Gray. Seems to hold its own there. So, and um, there you go, I made a deer. <laughs> it's standing there doing its thing we're going to be making some more here i'm going to make them smaller so i can put in that beautiful beautiful uh rack of um, antlers so um 
this is just a short video for today everybody i hope you enjoyed it and um you know just have a great day and and ex play with your art experiment with your art um the only way to go from here is up so um yeah i hope you enjoy that um if you like it subscribe share it was it's all appreciated all right i love you all all right bye